You guys, it's that time of year again. Jason from Rigid is reminding me that Christmas is coming up, the holidays. I'm a bah humbug. I hate the holidays. I don't like seeing the lights. What? I don't like Christmas. I don't. The garage is packed. I know. The garage is packed, but it's awesome. You could be Santa Claus. Yeah, I know. Okay. Actually, that'd be pretty cool, wouldn't it? Yeah. Would it be like, hey, Christmas Day, you guys come over and we'll give you guys. Yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll go on Face. We'll go on uh, Periscope and we'll be like, hey, whoever comes in the next five minutes can get all this stuff for free. Okay. And whoever comes, you know? No, we're kidding, you guys. Uh, rigid new stuff coming out for the holidays from Home Depot. But before we start, give us a little background on Rigid. What's what's up with Rigid? Rigid's got a lot of cool things coming out. What are they? Are they a pro brand though, or are they? Because a lot of people get mixed reactions to Rigid. Yeah, definitely a pro brand. If you if you look at the Rigid line, you've got everything to build a house, right? Everything from pneumatics, compressors, drill drivers, saws. You can do some woodworking, so you've got everything you need to build a house, which is, makes it contractor worthy. Right. And it's covered with a warranty of lifetime. Lifetime. But with the lifetime warranty, you have to register the product yes. within the X amount of days, right? You've got about 90 days to register, and you can register everything online. Okay. And batteries only if they come with kits. Correct. Okay. So if you guys buy an individual battery, it has a, how long of a warranty? It's like a one year warranty on okay. an individual battery. Okay. So buying a kit always. Oh, pays off better you get rewarded better but back so, to the new stuff new <clears throat> stuff 2016 tell us if it's available too is this on the market right now this will be on the market here within the next 30 days okay and what do we we are i think we already did a video on this yes you did but we didn't cover it enough because someone came in cody if you're out there cody came in and said hey one of them was a hybrid light me and eric looked at each other because we're professional amateurs as usual idiots what's the cord for hybrid so, but this one's a different kind of hybrid than the other one. Correct. Because the panel light is AC hybrid, when this is DC hybrid. Yeah, so this is a 12 volt. So for all you people that have, wow. have a cigarette lighter in their car or truck. Right. You know what? That's really good for the boat. Because you need a spotlight on the boat. And yeah, it's, my it's dad, Is it a requirement? Well, I don't know if it's a requirement around here. I mean, okay. it's probably a good idea if you're going at night. But my dad had one, and he had this just cheap old crappy one, and it just sucked. That would be awesome. Yeah, it's 12 feet long, too, so... 12 foot, 12 foot long cord. And then the battery, the lumens are the same? Yes. And you're calling this the light cannon, why, it's 1,000 lumens? It's like 2,500 lumens. 2,500 lumens, wow, that's crazy. And, and you can dial it up or dial it back. Whatever and it's like a spotlight? Or spotlight, so if you don't like the neighbors? Yeah, it is pretty bright, it is pretty bright. And that's one thing I didn't talk about in the video, is the brightness of it, you know? I'm just saying that because he's here and he'll yell at me. <laughs> just kidding. No, but the, it was the brightness, Jason. Seriously, that thing is bright. It's one of the brightest lights I've seen, yep. actually. Mm, it's got four super bright Cree, Cree branded LEDs. As you can see, it's got 180 degrees of bevel movement, too. Yes. Yeah, what is the price point on this? $89. $89 without a without battery? Without the battery. Okay, got it. And it'll run off all the batteries, the slim packs, all the way up to the 6.0s. Do you have 6.0s now? Not yet. 5.0s. 5.0s. Okay. You were talking about those 25.0s. No, those are all oh, that's Hawaii in, 5 -0? <laughs> That's in 25 -0s. That's in 2019. The 25. All right, come on, excitement. Mm. What else? I'm not, I was going to throw this, but Eric just gave me a dirty look. <laughs> so I'm not going to because Eric <clears throat> wants this. So I will put it here. Okay, I'm sorry. We Eric. got the uh, floodlight as well. Now, this one is is this a hybrid also? Well, let's take a look. Well, if you have to look that hard, no, right? Okay. This is just a battery driven only. Okay. Again, works to follow the rigid 18 volt batteries. It's got the same dial on it, so you, it, as soon as you turn it on, it's at full brightness. Right. Which is again is over 2,000 uh, lumens. And but this you, is more of a flood. Yes, yeah, so you can dial it back, and it's got a several different mounting options. This little space here, you can wedge it in a two by four. You can hang it on some string. <clears throat> on the underside of it, you've got the tripod capability, which we'll talk about that in just a second. Uh, a couple of keyholes as well, and just easy to kind of just lug around the job site. And it's got a little takeoff me mechanism as well, so you just flip the switch here on the back side, and voila. There cool. you go. Now you can kind of take it around and shine it wherever you need it. Right, right. 
And that, that kind of, like, it's pretty cool because, seriously, if you put a slim pack on here, you're going to get in. If you're a plumber, you're going to be able to go under a sink, Tight throw spaces. it in there. Rather than get this whole bulky thing, take it in with you, hit yourself on the head. Now you're bleeding. you got to get Band-Aids. just your day just goes bad. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, no, that is pretty cool. Now, availability and price point on this. You're looking at about, uh, what, I think it's $69 or $79. Okay. Uh, towards the latter part of October. Okay, cool. And uh, Home Depot. Home Depot only, correct. Okay. So you guys, if it is seventy nine, if it is seventy nine dollars, he said sixty nine. Just I'll give you his address at the end, and he'll give you the ten bucks back personally. Because we're very <laughs> accurate here on Tools in Action. Very. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, this is exciting. This got Eric excited. Um, first of its kind, really, because I don't know of any other. Except you mentioned there was a Ryobi Nikad version. <laughs> yeah, back, back in the, the OnePlus day. line, right. eight nine years ago, and uh, we definitely have uh, quite a few improvements. But that OnePlus line now, nine years ago, that could still use today's battery, right? Yeah. So really, cool. whoever has that router and it was uh, unimpressed with the power, is going to throw a lithium on it right now and it's going to scream. Yes. Or they can go ahead and get this. So. <laughs> right? <clears throat> Laminate trimmer or more commonly referred to as a uh, trim router. Great. So any quarter inch shank bit will fit into this little router. Uh, and any battery from Rigid will fit into it, as long as it's 18. Minutes. I've got the new 5.0 battery in there, so you've got... Shoot, you've got hours of routing time now. You hours, got, really? Hours. If you Are want you a kidding? slow setting, let's just let's go let's go to dinner. We'll come back and right. see if it's running. Uh, it's got a soft start mechanism, brushless motor, a variable speed dial on the back side here, so you can really get yourself dialed in and not burn the wood that you're working with. Um, easy to adjust as well. You got a quick override to go in and out. Or adjust the uh, depth mechanism, and you've got this micro adjust if you really. Wow, I do like detail. that system. That is really cool how you yeah. can just. Cool, and then the balance on that's really good. And like working without a cord, seriously, one of the problems with a router is the cord. I hate the cord. It, like yeah, I feel it. like sometimes it's in my way. Not that I'm a huge router. I'm not allowed to use routers. Eric doesn't let me. But if I were to use routers. Yeah, and it's going to come with the <clears throat> additional round base, the edge guide. It'll come with the flush trim bit. All that without the battery for 99 bucks. Not bad at all. And technically, you could put that in a router table, right? Well, if you get the holes to line up correctly. Yeah, yeah. you could throw that thing in a router table. Then, you know, then you got a portable on the job, you know, like a little trim router. Yep. I added that one in there for you, dude. I like that. Yeah, now you're going to sell twice as many. Mm, what do you got here? What do you got here? We're going to go back here. Whoa. Check it out, you guys. The panel lights. Is that what they call it? Yeah. This is the panel light that uh, basically we didn't talk about that is hybrid. Basically, you can run an extension cord to it, and you can also run the battery to it. So how many lumens we got on this, Jason? Yeah, you're looking over 2,000 lumens on this as well. Wow. And you know what? The night we did get these, I was doing someone's headlights, like cleaning the headlights, and I actually used it, and it lit up the whole area. It was really good. So I don't want to blow you guys out here. So. Close your eyes, Eric. There you go. Yeah, you can put the flaps back, and you got almost 180 degrees of lighting, which is pretty cool. Super bright. Don't look into the light. I know. Or I've just shut seeing, it off. I've been seeing yellow. There you go. Cool. For a while. You're looking at about 79 to 99. I see 99 dollars. Okay. Without a battery. And hybrid. End of October on this. End of October on this as well. Okay. What's up with this stand at the time? What's up with the stand? <clears throat> this is a universal tripod, not any any ordinary tripod. A fully adjustable. You've got several different settings. And the ability to put not one, but two, but three different lights, all with that quarter inch 20 uh, thread. So it's a standard, standard thread. Size. Now I know you're saying this and you probably don't want to hear this, but that th thing's awesome for photography. Awesome. Because you can put cameras on it, you can put mic rigs on it, you can put a light on it all in the same time. Yeah. So, and, and I love the adjustments and it's portable. Yeah. So you, let's say you're an interior designer, maybe you're a contractor, you want to take a picture of your work when you're done, set up a couple of lights, put your camera on there as well. Yeah. So you're done. Now, is that thing, um, uh, this will be in the warranty? stores? It's lifetime warranty. Well, no, no, there's if no break, it's not a lifetime warranty. Oh, but I mean, if something goes wrong with it, right? Yeah, we'll cover it with a three year warranty. Um, right. after that, we'll service it as well. So, so. cool. And you know, what would be cool to put it like a, a, a 18 volt battery at it, and the little blades on the bottom start spinning and it flies around. Would that be cool? And just follows you when are you coming out with that. Next That's year. what these guys want to know. When? Next, no, well, next no, year. Oh, next year. You heard it, you guys. <laughs> you heard it. This is exciting. We always have a good time when Jason comes to town and shows off the new products 
Foam rigid. What is? Oh my god, a wobble light. We don't like to say that. That's a competitor upright, brand. Wobble upright. Light. Um, so this is always gonna go. Well, I, dude, I was gonna catch it. <laughs> it shatters. No, it's pretty strong because we did see this at the event in New York, and you did beat it up. Yes. It's a pretty. Go ahead. I'm sorry. That was the weight about uh, 15, 20 pounds. Yeah, but it needs the weight in the bottom, right? Yep. Okay. So it's always gonna come back upright. That's why you call it the upright light. Um, uh, uses 18 volt batteries. Could be the 5 -0, could be the 2 -0. Um, your choice. So what kind of runtime are we gonna get You put then? this 5-0 battery in there and you run this thing on its, on its lowest setting, you're looking up to 75 hours of light, mm -hmm. light time. Are you kidding me? Not kidding. That's insane. It just dropped the mic. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's insane. Yeah. What about on high? High, you're probably looking somewhere in the 24 to 30 hours. That's insane. That that's really good. I mean, seriously, that's something for like a job site security situation. You know, you could throw these up in the up of the job site. You know, obviously they'll probably get stolen, but you know, maybe yeah. something will get seen. <laughs> and if you're in an environment where you've got a cord, it's a hybrid unit, so you could actually plug in the unit. Um, How many lumens are we talking on this? Uh, you're looking over a thousand lumens. So it's plenty, you know, oh. plenty, plenty of light. And you even got a place for the cord to come out. That's pretty cord cool. Cord come out, so it's somewhat weatherproof. Obviously, you're not going to want to put it in the water. Right. Um, but it will, you know, obviously, the way it's shaped, the water will kind of run off everywhere. And what does it have? One big, a bunch of Cree LEDs up yeah, in here? exactly. Are you, really, Cree's? You guys Cree's, are using Cree? Yeah. You guys, if you don't know about Cree, basically, Cree's a brand of LED that's known for quality and innovation. And uh, it's just generally what people tend to really like is Cree LEDs. They're just a company that really uh, makes good LEDs. So now we got this little SDS. Oh, when was that on the market? The end of October. Okay. Home Depot, you guys. Home Depot, homedepot.com. Homedepot.com. <clears throat> You've been eating a lot of candy, so. I know. He brought us, look at you guys. He brought us over this little Home Depot bucket with all this candy. It I was wish I could, full. It was full, but Eric ate most of it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, what do we got with this SDS? Do you have a, like a loose filling? We can. Wow, that was good. That was good. Well, yeah, you want to try it? Let's try it. Hey, well, let's do that in a separate video so we can have um, a viral video. Yeah, so this is Ridge's uh, very first. SDS hammer, rotary hammer drill. Corded or cordless, they've never had one before? Not in the U.S. No. Wow, okay. So, <clears throat> again, uh, super compact. It's got your four modes, which are? Uh, chip, chip and hammer, hammer, and freewheel. Exactly. Wow. A professional amateur, it's working, dude. <laughs> it's working. This will be on the market come October as well, probably closer to November. Right. But no, that is pretty cool though. Uh, and LED light or anything on the front, anything notable? It's no pretty uh, destructive tool, so. Okay, so it's pretty much like that warranty? Yes. All right, cool. I do like the lightweight of it and it being 20 volts, because it's the size of some 12 volts. Does Mark have a 12 volt like that, Eric? Yes. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> wow, a hammer. <laughs> <laughs> what do we got? A framing nailer. Three and a half inch framing nailer. Now, is Rigid known for their nailers? I mean, because I see a lot of new Rigid nailers out on the job site. Yeah, with, with a combination of uh, three to four compressors uh, and uh, six to seven nail guns. Yeah, it's a full line of guns. Yeah. And we've had them in the market now for over eight years now, so. And these are lifetime a, warranty, too? Uh, yes. Right, and the crazy thing is, is I mean, that's, that's, that's uh, an Old industrial. Rings, pistons, it wow. covers everything. Really? So. so you just can get it fixed at any time. And that's in a professional environment, too. Yeah. So it doesn't matter how hard the guy uses it, as long as he doesn't physically break it, like damage. Or wise. run over it with your vent track. Right. Well. Don't do that. I won't. I'm <laughs> as we do a B roll right now, we're running <laughs> over with the vent track. Now, hey, what did you think of the vent track? It's pretty cool. Yeah. Even Jason likes the vent track. Mm. We're gonna have tons of videos on the vent track. The vent track rules. Sorry, we have to do a plug for vent okay. track because it's such a good tractor. It's like the rigid of tractors. How about that? Uh, where's the Jimmy John's cup? <laughs> Inside joke, you guys. He thinks we should get, hit Jimmy John's up to be our sponsor because we've had Jimmy John cups up in the past, but really we're just two losers in the garage. They don't want nothing to do with us. Only Rigid comes and visits us. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What, yeah what's, what's the key feature? Eight nails a second. Wow. Who can even nail that fast? Let's try it. With a Are you serious? We can do that another time. Yeah, we'll do that another time. Um, what does the MG mean? Magnesium housing. Keep oh, the wow, weight okay. down. 
You've got swivel the, on the swivel back. On the belt. You actually have it included. Swivel for the NPT or yeah. NTP fitting, whatever the they quarter call inch it. coupler. Yeah, it comes with it standard. It's not an option. Uh, dry fire lockout, so you won't inadvertently be shooting. So this is designed for like the Amish who are just building those things really fast. They want one of these because they can do eight nails a second, right? Who's no? that? The I Amish. That guy's okay. Sure. Is this is what the, this is what the Amish do. Hey, you know who that is? Stuart, the tool guide. He's calling us, but we're busy right now. We can't talk to him. We should have brought him in on this, but we will another time. You guys, sorry, everybody's left. Let's get it. Come back. Come back. All right, back to the nailer. Sorry. Yeah, fully featured. Awesome unit. Fast. Oh, fully. I guess it's fully featured again. And pretty lightweight for a large gun. I mean, yeah. Even though I have tennis elbow, I can still lift it. I have tennis. Did I tell you I have tennis elbow? No. Bad man. I like the trigger too. Oh, I like the rubber on the trigger there. Seriously, you don't see that a lot. Rubber mold. Yeah, you just see uh, pretty much just a regular trigger. Sequential, bump fire, dry fire lockout. Yeah, it's a nice gun, man. <clears throat> it's like $279 available at Depot today. Depot today. Right now. No special nails, just 21 degree framers and you're ready to go? Exactly. Okay, good stuff. Let's go shopping. Really? Yeah. All right. It's the holidays, right? Yeah, what are we going to buy? Well, some batteries. We need some batteries. Yeah. All right, I guess we're, we're are you buying? <laughs> some more candy. Dude, he's taking us shopping. <laughs> it's insane. It's awesome. You guys, that's the new stuff from Rigid. It's going to be out later this year. Let us know what you guys want to see or what you think about Rigid at the bottom. Be nice to Jason because it's his first time on TV. And, uh, you know, especially a big channel like this where, uh, you know, six or seven people are going to see him in about a week. So, Tools in Action, hashtag TA Crew, and what, RigidTools.com? No, Rigid.com backslash Power Tools. Correct. Rigid.com backslash power tools. We'll put the link below. Tools in action. For more exciting tool action, go to toolsinaction.com.